Coach Rose, and I'm going to show you how to wrap your hands for a typical boxing workout. Now this is just for a workout. If it were an actual fight, your coach would wrap your hands with gauze and athletic tape. That takes a few minutes to do. It also takes an extra set of hands, so I'm going to show you that on a different video. So today we're just going to talk about your typical workout. You're going to use a pair of hand wraps. You can get these at a sporting goods store or you can order them off the internet. At one end of the wrap, you're going to have a loop and at the other end, the Velcro. So you're going to take the loop, put it around your thumb, start at your wrist. You're going to go two or three times around your wrist. You want to get this snug, but not tight. You also want to keep your fingers spread apart the entire time you wrap. Okay, so two or three times around the wrist, cross over the top of the hand. Now I'm going to go around the knuckles two or three times. Now I'm going to come underneath, behind the thumb, go around the base of the thumb. Come over the top. As I come over the top of the hand, I'm going to go around the thumb again from the top. Now I've got the thumb from the top and the bottom. Okay, back around the wrist, cross back over to the knuckles. Now I'm going to spend quite a bit of wrap on the knuckles. Now when I get to about two or three feet left, I'm going to make an X on the back of my hand. So I'm going to cross back over to the wrist, back to the front, and then back up to the wrist where I'll finish it off. And there you go. That's a good wrap for a workout. If I make a fist, my knuckles are still hidden behind the wrap. I have a good wrist protection and I have a good base on my thumb. One of the more common things that might happen while you're working out is the wrap will start to come undone. So one of the things you can do is just take the wrap back down to where you have about three or four feet left. And then when you come around the wrist, you're gonna come in between your fingers like that, and then come back around your wrist Make your X on top and then finish back at your wrist. So by going through your fingers, you help secure the wrap and keep it from coming off. Um, you also have these quick wraps, but that's what I call them, quick wraps. Um, they just slip on your hand and then you just secure the strap around your wrist. Uh, I think these are okay for a quick workout. Um, I probably would spar with these um, because there's not enough wrist support for me and there's practically no thumb support. Um, although the knuckle coverage is excellent. So, um, you know, I do, I use them for the videos and they work pretty good. So, um, I don't hate these. You know, these are, these are actually kind of cool. But um, if you're really going to get down to business, I would definitely use an actual hand wrap. So that's it. That's a good wrap job for a typical workout. It's quick, it's easy, it gets the job done. I've got the knuckles, the thumb, and the wrist. I'm ready to go. That's it, train hard, and I'll see you next time.